If you're taking Algebra 1 this year and you don't know what positive association or negative association is, don't worry, I got you. So I went ahead and drew the three types of association that we're going to see in Algebra 1, okay? And so it's really simple. We're just going to look at these graphs from left to right and see if we see any kind of pattern or association with the points, okay? So for our first example, as we go from left to right, what do you notice about the points? Okay, they're increasing, almost like it has a positive slope, right? Now, they're not exactly in a perfect line, but they are close enough so that we can see the pattern, and we can tell that generally, as X increases, Y is also increasing, okay? So again, we're looking at it from left to right. As we go from left to right, our points are getting higher and higher. And so that means that we're going to have a positive association for that scatter plot. Okay. Now for our next one, you can probably guess it, but let's go ahead and go through it. So this time, as we go from left to right, our points are coming down or decreasing. Okay. And so that's going to be a negative association. All right. Think of it as a negative slope, right? As we go from left to right or as X increases, Y is decreasing, okay? And then this last example. So we just have a lot of random points on here that don't really have a pattern. There's not really a line to look at. And so if there's no pattern like this, we're just gonna say that that is no association. And that's all you have to do. 